The world is moving faster than ever before, so it is increasingly important to make sure the right information flows to where it is needed, when it is needed. This is nowhere more apparent than in the rapidly changing transport sector. For example, a road may be changed from two-way to one-way. Your satellite navigation system must be fully updated to give you an alternative route. Or there might be a change in the speed limit for a section of the road. All these updates managed by the public road authorities should find their way to you. Commercial map providers like HERE and TomTom need accurate and up-to-date road databases for their SatNav systems and other applications. But road data come from many different sources and are communicated in different ways. Since 2010, European public authorities have been implementing the INSPIRE directive. INSPIRE is a framework of legislation, data and services to share harmonized geodata for environmental policy, including transport network data. Further to this, the Intelligent Transport Systems Directive, introduced in 2010, has additional requirements for electronic data exchange between public authorities and third parties. Bringing these two elements together, the European Union Location Framework Project recently started a pilot to enhance the way public authorities exchange road data with third parties based on INSPIRE. The pilot is being run in Norway and Sweden in collaboration with the country's road authorities and mapping agencies, as well as the commercial map providers. It aims to improve the communication of changes in road data, such as speed limits and access restrictions. The data exchange standard from the ITS community, called TN-ITS, helps to describe what attributes are changed on the road network and the positioning of these changes along the road. Also, the mapping agencies can help map providers to position reference data, like buildings and rivers, and deal with any cross-border discrepancies. They are working under the European Location Framework Project, ELF, to provide data seamlessly across borders. INSPIRE underpins both TNITS and ELF. By joining forces with all these partners, both in the public and private sector, the EULF Transport Pilot standardizes the way of exchanging critical safety updates to maps. Changes will be processed faster and more seamlessly. This will be even more relevant in the future with new advances in assisted driving technology which will require increasingly accurate data. After this first phase of the pilot, the goal will be to extend it to other countries. Besides the transportation pilot, the EULF is also working on pilots in the marine and energy domains to stimulate location-enabled e-government and to bring benefits to all.